my Skitty Cats, my name is Kate from Skitty Cat Gaming, and we are back in with the Dark Side Detective. Now, I'm super excited about these bonus things. Uh, <laughs> there's two of them left, uh, and this one is called Polter Guys. Not Polter Guys, Polter, Polter Guys. Uh, case summary Dinner with the Dooley family. Thanks for coming to dinner, detective. My sister loves meeting my colleagues. Julie, I've been coming to dinner your sister's once a month for years, and she loves it. Let's get inside before my tummy revolts. Oh, look at this friendless chap, no Malone. We bought him, we, yeah, we bought him a friend, but it got lost in New York. Did you take the squad car over? I was running late. Sirens are a hungry boy's best friend. Oh, do we? Why is there no sound out of these? They broke last summer, so I glued them back together. Glued them up real good. <sighs> do we? What the? What's going on here? Yeah, Buzz, turn the TV off if you're playing. Your joy child, electronic. Electricity doesn't grow in trees. No, Dooley, it's a TV. What? I just told him. It's alive. Yes! Alive! And angry. The things kid watch these days. Huh? Dooley, interesting piece. Mom painted it. It's called I Have No Mouth and I Must Scream. I know exactly what that means. Let's see. The workout horror flick, The Exorcist. A story about some vampires real realizing the error of their ways, the found boys, and an and the incredibly tame fantasy adventure classic. No trouble in little Italy. Wait, these aren't books. This is a hidden safe, but there's nothing inside it. I wouldn't leave anything worth. I wouldn't leave anything of worth in a place like that. There's a lot of book seats around this area. They might steal your valuables by mistake, and then everyone would be upset. Daisies are my favorite type of flower. Mine told me all. The colonel needs to need his fiber. It's vi that's vile. Let's just unplug it. I don't think so. Zap, zap, zap. Ow! Ha 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 ha! Take that. Popcorn. You'll ruin your appetite with that garbage, Buzz. All the more dinner for you to eat, then. We need to get this kid more snacks, Stad. <laughs> Ugh, what? Hey, Buzz. Ugh, you make me lose my high score. I hate you! Kids are such magical creatures, eh, detective? What's going on here? Nothing. Buzz, tell your uncle detective, unky detective, what happened. Ugh, fine. Mom rented a video to which after dinner, to watch after dinner, but I was bored and put it, in, put it on. Then the TV flipped out, so I played my game. Where did you rent this video from? Indian Bur Burial Ground Video Rentals, Inc. Um... Where's the tape now? I don't know, it's still on the machine, I guess. <laughs> he sounds like a girl, <laughs> like a sassy teen girl. Did you try to eject it? Why would I do that? God. Other than there being a thing in your TV? God, leave me alone, you're ruining my game. Bye. <laughs> Whatever. I wonder if I can just eject the tape. Nah, <laughs> cause that. Oh, it's my fingers. I need some other way to remove it. Haha, <laughs> good luck, flesh bag. I could just break the TV. Glad you guys can make it. Thanks for inviting- That door is glowing. That door is glowing. Thanks for inviting us, Patricia. I wore my spandex uniform so I'd have more room for seconds. Hi, Francis. I hope you brought your appetite with you. I did. Thanks for having me. My pleasure, Francis. You know I love when you visit. Mmm. 
Fry it up with some onion and garlic and anything will smell good. <laughs> I'm sure it would be lovely. It will be better than the steady diet of coffee and donuts anyway. Patricia, have you noticed anything unusual since Bud tried out that tape? He washed it already? That boy, so exhausting. Sorry, Francis, I've been running all over the place getting dinner ready, so I don't think I've ha I'd have noticed any, even if the walls were closing in around me. Hmm, garlic is good for chasing off unnatural things. May I take some? Sure, Here, here's some leftovers. It'll leave your hands smelling divine. Goodbye. Talk soon, Francis. Aww, fancy chocolates. Coffee's getting these for later. Good plan. Careful now, it's piping hot. Pur purge soda? What goes down must come back up. Ugh. Popular tarts. The breakfast treat of choice for premonitious children. Serial killer spots them while they're young. Baked bean pizza because the little people in your life are disgusting. Need some help taking out the washing? Always. Buzz is useless when it comes to choice. Thank you, Francis. A waterfall, waterfall scented bed sheet. It's not scented. It's just still wet. Spooky doorway. So what's going on in here? Buzz must have left the pantry light on. He's forever leaving lights on. Does he think electricity grows on trees? That's not a saying. Um, did your sister get an extension built onto the house? On little Buzz's income? Unlikely. There's a remote control. I wonder if they're missing... <laughs> Here's the top sign. I wish I could stop sign. And I wish I could. Why is there no actual food in this pantry? You've got a pretty judgy expression for a rubber duck trapped outside the time and space. I can never foresee a situation where I want to carry a pot around in my jack pocket. Don't eat too much dinner. Don't eat too much. Dinner will be ready soon. I won't. I just need to borrow these uh, sausages. No, no, no more snacking, honestly, you boys. I'm not doing that in Patricia's home. Wait, I could use the sausages as like a rope. They won't reach, even if they did, they'd only make the remote too greasy to pick up. I need something less greasy to use with this. It won't reach by itself. In a situation... In no situation is this a safe length of rope. Okay, Dooley, hold on to this as tightly as you can. I'll never let go, Jack. Uh, don't say that. She did let go. She held on to the prompt. Hey, let's discuss this over dinner. Right now, it's time to grab the remote. Fine. It's a dead remote. Hi, Francis. I hope you brought your appetite with you. Your pantry. Have you noticed anything dimensional about it? Well, there has been a draft coming from it today. Is that what you mean? Uh, sure. I'll see if I can fix that. That would be fantastic, but try not to get too dirty. Dinner will be ready soon. Goodbye. Talk soon. Nothing's happening. I am invincible. Uh, the batteries are dead. God. Nah, they're good. I'm just all powerful. Don't look for new ones. Just give up and accept your fate. No! Why would I just accept my fate? I'll ask for batteries. batteries anywhere? Hey, give me your batteries. Ugh, what? I need your joy, joy drugs back. Make it worth my while and I'll talk about it. What happened to respecting your elders? You can't get rich off of respect. I don't know. I thought that Franklin did okay from it. Pfft, whatever. Hey Buzz, want some chocolate? Yes. I'll trade you for the batteries from your joy child. 
No way. Okay, more delicious chocolate for Julie and me. Hooray! Fine, I'll trade. Aw. That's the remote back up and running. Get away from me! You received evil vengeance. Give me back my tape, you monster! You want to crush us all and I'm the monster? This won't stop me, you know. I'm still gonna squish you all. Only now, I'll make it slow. Hmm, maybe I can do something else to this tape that will help me get rid of that thing. I don't need or want to go back in there. Only a terrible guess would do that. Hopefully we can stink the evil out of the tape. It won't work until the juices have baked in and purified the tape. Baked in, you say? I just have to put this in here for a moment so the garlic juices can melt and go into the it. And it's ready. Yeah, give me that. Wait. This doesn't taste right. Ah! Damn you! <coughs> that hurt my throat. <coughs> it seems to have chased it off. What are you boys are playing at? It's time to wrap it up. Dinner's on the table. Ugh. Now that's what I call perfect alignment of events. It's perfect timing. What is? Per <sighs> You know what? Never mind. Let's go eat. Bacon, cabbage, and potato. My favorite. Eat up, everyone. I want my three best boys ready for whatever the world throws at them. Thanks, Patricia. No need to thank me. We're all family here. Ugh. Grown-ups are lame. Is it, though? Because that pantry is pretty spooky. It is. Alright, well, I'm actually going to end this episode here. I'm sorry that this was so short, but I want to do these in different episodes. That way, you know, I, that way they all have like a specific theme for them. Alright, so I'm going to end this episode here. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. And if you'd like to follow me on Twitter and Instagram, I'll put the links in the description below. Until next time, until next time right there for my scaredy cats. Bye-bye! Yeah.